Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the field the Briarwood Christian Lions. You know, it felt good. It always feels good to be 2-0. Um, you know, the, the third quarter has not been kind of us to us two weeks in a row, you know. And, um, you know, we, we pretty much self-destruct in the second half. Way too many penalties. Um, you know, we had some great individual performances tonight. But then again, we really never sustained any drives tonight. So, you know, that'll catch up with you down the road. So, um, I'm proud of the guys, you know. Um, um, Will Myers had a big night. Colin Neal had some big grabs. Um, you know, but still, we got to get where we sustain drives. Is that the main takeaway tonight? That is, to me, it is. It is. You know, we're living off of big plays right now, and, we, and, and we've got to we've got to sustain some drives. How about defense? Like I know Briarwood's got a running back now. They can really yeah. Run the ball against y'all, but y'all have a lot to do with. Yeah, yeah, our our defense has been playing really well. You know, I don't think we gave up any big plays tonight. Um, we played, you know, and they got the ball down in the red zone a couple of times. We came up with big stops. Former Jordan next week, region play begins. Yeah, I'm ready to What's get into region play. Hey, hey, we just have a bad taste in our mouth from last year, and we're ready. We're ready to roll. Just tell me, kind of trying to run the ball against them. You know, loops out right now. Yeah, I think I think Homewood's got a really good team. Like you boil it down, um, why do we have trouble running the ball? Because they've got a good front seven, and so we're going to get better. We're going to learn. Uh, we're going to handle a three-four, and we'll be fine with that. Uh, but they've got a good team. Like they were always a team when I scheduled them. I knew that they were going to be very good. So there's no surprise that we had trouble running the ball. I knew the quarterback was be good. We we didn't do a good job of handling him either. So there's some real reasons. You put Homewood on the schedule because you want to play tough games and you want to play tough physical opponents. And they really came out and fought us. So uh, hats off to them, and we're going to learn and we're going to get better. To take away a couple of those big just first runs from him, y'all really kind of kept yeah. mostly in shape. Did you feel good about that? Yeah, I mean, you know, you take out the what, three or four just huge plays, just booms. Like, you know, what does a good defense has to do? A good defense has to not give up the long play. So we're going to get better at that. We're going to be more sound to do the little things right. But a good defense is not going to give up big plays. And we gave up four big plays that were really costly. So we'll learn. We'll get better. We made adjustments in the second half. I'm proud of how the guys responded to those adjustments and how much energy they played with. Like, you down 28-7, you can pack it in. But a lot of teams will, but this team won't. And that's a testament to their parents and how they're raised. How'd you feel about the quarterback play? Not good. There's some real shiny moments from both quarterbacks that are doing really good stuff. So I'm, I'm excited to continue working through this. Um, you know, we want to play the best guys. And if a lot of guys can play, we'll play a lot of guys. You mentioned it to them. Maybe some of them are too young. But the last time y'all did start 0-2, <laughs> what happened? Last time we started 0-2, uh, I remember. I still remember walking across the field to shake Coach LeBeau's head, thinking, "What in the hand? Thinking, what in the world is happening?" But yeah, we uh, put it all together and we had us a nice little run. And 
Uh, we met them up in the semifinals, so we'll see what happens. How do you prepare for region play? You got Ramsey coming in next week. Yeah, I mean, part of the reason, you know, I know Ramsey scheduled tough games. I know we scheduled tough games because you're expecting uh, that week three, uh, that third game of the season to really matter. And so Ramsey's a good team. Um, they've just played really good opponents, and so we'll expect a dogfight on Friday night.